I'm Cheryl Hickey. This is my dad, John Hickey. Hello. And how my dad empowered me growing up, I would say, was you always told me or taught me that um, reach for the top, reach for the top, uh, reach for the most, and then work your way. And if something didn't work out, then you figure that out from there. It, was, it wasn't just see what you can get. It was always go for the, the big thing, go for the number one thing. Oh, that's good. That's good to hear. <laughs> but I can't take all the credit. Yeah. Because my wife and I, yeah. we've been married for 50 years, coming up in January. Mm -hmm. And it's, it's been the two of us who have empowered you yeah, to be all true. your things. So I can't really say I, me. I have to use the pronoun we. Yes. Because we, we've unconditionally loved you. Yeah. We gave every chance in the world to have you do things yes. on your own, mm -hmm. have your bumps. We became good listeners. That's true. You we became listeners. very good listeners. And we, we criticized, too. They did. You can't forget that. Yeah, but lovingly. In, in a loving manner, yeah, of course. in a learning way. Of course. And you also drove me to summer school and made me go. All the time. Yes. No, I only had to go once. Right? Well, yes, but we made sure we made a couple trips to Meaford. Yes. In from Owen Sound to this Meaford. Is true. Yes, we this did. This is true. Yes. But did you always want your girls to be strong and be able to stand on our own two feet? Of course. I wanted you to become independent later on in life. And if you have all these skills and things behind you, you can achieve that. Is it still hard for you to not be super Definitely. Protective? Oh, <laughs> is it ever difficult? <laughs> well, I appreciate it. Well, thank you very much. And I much. love you. Can I kiss you? Yes, you can. I can. That's good.